day is it? It's Monday. Monday... No, Sunday. Sunday a third. I'm already jumping ahead with my uh, mornings. Um, but yeah, it's a late night cast. Hi. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I didn't do very much tidying up. My room actually looks even dirtier than it did last time I streamed. <laughs> but um, tomorrow. Tomorrow's another day. Um, does not help that I'm probably planning on staying up for an hour or two playing video games instead of sleeping and waking up early, but uh, that's something I can worry about tomorrow. So, anyway, back to um, bringing back Keel or whoever. Um, we can see where we last left off. Alright. Hey, Chaos. Welcome. Glad you can make it. I hope I didn't interrupt any of your sleeping. <laughs> ah, that's right. Now I remember. I am in the village of the Satyros. And they all hate me, because I'm human. <laughs> Doing well, Chaos. Doing well. Um, it's been a pretty pretty nice and relaxing day. Reaper and I went out and went to hunt hunt for gerbs. I know, sleeping? <laughs> Chaos doesn't sleep, we all know that. <laughs> oh, Chaos. So hopefully... <laughs> I appreciate it. <laughs> I know, I know you had tweeted a few hours ago about wondering whether you need to go to bed or not, depending on if anyone is streaming. Um, Reaper and I were actually pulled into uh, Jack LaFear's cast a little bit, watching his podcast. I had never seen him before, but uh, I know Archelaus has strongly recommended him, and, um, and uh, I thought since he was streaming, but uh, I finally got a chance to catch a little bit of it. It's pretty intriguing. Let's see. Ah, yes. <laughs> I saw your tweet. I saw your tweet. Oh, it looks like my, uh, there it goes. My Twitch chat has been well worn there. All right, I think, let's see if I go out here. Ooh. And the shards. Yeah, I thought it was pretty interesting. They had interesting questions for their um for the visiting streamers. Um asking things like uh what about them changes uh, when they go live versus uh, who they are normally? So it feels. I guess I'll go, go over here. Thank you, Chaos. I noticed that. I thought that was very sweet. Yeah, once I saw that, I was like, oh, I guess Chaos must stop you awake. <laughs> Alright. This looks like something I should probably map out, actually. My my graph paper is still here. Let's see. This is Seaside Road. Let's see where this takes us. The map does still live, yes. <laughs> oh, looks like there's some treasure. <laughs> so it looks like the only way it can go is up. Okay, that's good to know. Should mark that accordingly. <laughs> no, Keel is not living right now. <laughs> oh, that magic. 
magic barrel. Very interesting. I'm special power, so. <laughs> I know, Chaos. It's pretty late for everyone right now. Everyone except for, like, maybe Viking. <laughs> this is a perfect night for Viking to come on in. Um, but, uh, no, it's late. I, I don't expect many people to come on by, but it was actually pretty interesting where uh, uh, Zeke was in the uh, podcast with uh, Jack LaFere and was remarking that uh, uh, the number of viewers should never, never affect how... How you perform in your cast. Just act like you normally would, like if you had a whole bunch of people in here versus very few. Alright, let's see. Let's push these guys around. I actually don't know the skills for some of these other people. <laughs> uh, Kiel was, um, Maybe two or three streams ago, he uh, he was a new recruit for. Um, and let me know if the music's too loud, guys. It's kind of hard for me to tell right now. Um, it looks okay on my end, but uh, he was a new recruit who um, was basically the first hand man for um, Rosh, who is Stock's best friend, who is also another soldier, um, and. Uh, Stock got into a situation where um, both of them were going to die if he didn't do something, and so he was able to adjust history, but the history that he adjusted to still ended up having Kiel getting killed. Um, and so uh, he is making his attempts now to see if he can once again go back and change history again to avoid the ambush that killed Kiel. Thank you. Sounds good. Glad audio sounds good. Alright. She's bomb trap. Starlight. That would not be bad, actually. I'm just trying to think of the best best way to handle this group of folks. <laughs> Thank you, Reap. I see Reap also also treated me out very sweet. As a ground type. Hmm. 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 How best to handle this? Uh, okay. Maybe what I'll do.
Hey, uh, Aqua Steve. <laughs> How you doing? Thanks for coming by. <laughs> just caught me, I just started. Taking me a little bit to get back into remembering how to play this game, yeah. anything to steal but might as well might as well try oh yeah oh very nice Steve <laughs> oh can see that reap so watch that uh watch that extracurricular stream viewing that you might be doing <laughs> <laughs> and for people who don't know, that is uh, Reaper in the background there. <laughs> and hopefully I'm not getting too much interference from uh, on my mic. Um, I know I was roboting a little before. <laughs> super porn, not just regular porn. I mean, I got used to the regular porn, but if it's super porn, I gotta get used to that. <laughs> <laughs> now that he has a new new IP to deal with <laughs> that's awesome though Aqua Steve it's uh, ex exciting a brand new PC I definitely need some work on uh, my current one alright so looks like could go north. Oh, I see where I am. I see where I am now. Runeclaw. Hey, Danny. <laughs> I don't know. I just happened to be up this late, and I just had the energy, and I've been itching to play um, more uh, Radiant Historia, so here I am. Here I am. Uh, let's see. Moon claws. What is claws? Set to hidden mana. Wonder who can use these though. Ah. <laughs> Seth has his own stream. You guys can look for his face there. <laughs> Alright. Oh, very nice. Sounds great, Steve. That sounds like a good hookup, that's for sure. Um... Sorry guys, I'm just trying to figure out... I know I've been to this area before. I was trying to figure out how I can mark that on here, but I don't think I've mapped it out yet, so... Oh well. Uh, this area... <laughs> Let's see... Go up... Get to the rock slide... I am actually drawing a map right now, for anyone who's curious. <laughs> Treasure over there. Nothing over here. That's just another thing up there. Okay. <laughs> I hope so too, Chaos. Um, we're still doing a lot of moving around of things. Oh, eh. Uh, in, in the house. Um, so, yeah. 
It'll still be a little bit longer, plus we're still trying to figure out his PC, so... Yeah. A lot of people miss R Reaper. He gets to poke in on mine, of course, and in case he wants to stream for my rig, which he certainly can. Otherwise, the little laptop that could. He has his capture card, so he has some options. Um, although we do have some people coming to visit us tomorrow, so we will probably, probably neither of us will stream tomorrow. Yes, you can. <laughs> Unless Raiko streams, because his schedule is all crazy right now. <laughs> yeah, that's understandable, Reap. If you're not feeling it, then I wouldn't push it. I feel like if you push it, people will know, you know? That's fine. I've been itching to stream, so it all works out. <laughs> I've been playing a lot of um, Etrian Odyssey, making some good progress in that. I'm anxious to finish it um, so that I can actually play the second one on, on cast. That'd be really nice and to kind of have something to kind of switch between. Um, for these sort of RPG playthroughs, uh, and something a little, little more grinding and less story based, so as to not, uh, not get in the way. Oh, Last of Us, very nice. All right, I actually need my eraser. Let's see, where's my? Hold on, you guys. Let's hope I don't unplug anything. Cause I'm drawing my map pretty terribly. <laughs> don't mind all this noise. <laughs> uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> all right. I realize I drew my map wrong. <laughs> oh, and this shaky monitor doesn't help things. <laughs> what was that? I I know, but the fact is that it, cha it shakes the camera, <laughs> so that doesn't help things. So let's see. Oh no, I didn't mean to go invisible there. <laughs> let's see. <laughs> It's, it looks really pretty from what we've seen. Alright, so let's do this weird thing here. And somewhere over here. First person RPG? I mean, Etrian Odyssey is really kind of more of a classic, um, classic, um, 
RPG where you're just drawing maps. Like, literally, you're drawing maps. That's a big portion of the game. Um, very, very old school in that way. So it just depends on if you like that sort of thing, or it's a lot of labyrinths and mazes and finding secret doors um, and running into... Uh, um, oh, thank you, Arcalis. I don't know if you're here right now, but uh, thank you for the retweet. Um, it, uh, um, it just depends on if you're okay with that. Um, some people don't care for that sort of look, um, or they find it very repetitive and boring. Um, so I'm trying to think of what other games I would compare it with. I mean, Dark Spire is like that. Um, Shin Megami Tensei Strange Journey is also like that. Um, few others, and so it's not really for everyone um, if you're not into those sort of things. Um, I think Eternal Odyssey is a really good version of it, because uh, I have Dark Spire and Strange Journey, and as good as those are, they get very... It's very easy to get lost and lose track of what you're doing, and it can feel very monotonous in a lot of ways. Um, but I think the built-in map feature is actually really nice and really helps a lot, but uh, it is still a lot of repetition. Let's see, what am I doing here? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and push this guy back. I mean, I definitely recommend it. It's a, it's five titles long now. They redid the first one. Um, it's worth a rental, at least. Hey, Dry! <laughs> Good to see you again. Welcome back. That Dark Souls one... What is the, uh... Is it just a Prepare to Die edition? Is that considered DLC? Reaper would know, of course. Let's see. How you doing, Dry? You didn't miss too much. I'm still getting used to playing this game. <laughs> Uh, that's where I'm going to change with... Oh, I'm sorry, Dry. I know, all I did... I, I actually had streamed longer than I thought I would have. I streamed for about an hour, and I stream ended up streaming for about an hour and a half, and... And I knew it would be a short cast. I had to work the next day, unfortunately, but... Today should be a little better. I'm glad you could make it this time. I don't know how the time difference is for you, so hopefully not too bad. Yeah. That. Let's do a regular attack. Ah, uh, that's right, the Artorius. leveled up. I didn't realize how low of a level she is. She's pretty low compared to everyone else. Alright, let's see. Oh, that other noise. <laughs> Reap's phone. His phone is blown up. <laughs> Alright. So it looks like there's a way north. That's up to Alistair. Okay. 
Hey, Slacks. <laughs> All right, Chaos. How's it going, Slacks? Good to see you. I'm surprised you're still awake. It's well, actually, you went to a party, so that explains it. Gotcha. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, that preemptive attack. Ah, uh, no. I don't know how much this will help me. Mm, let's see. Let's do this. And then change with him. Oh, you're still at the party. Yeah, I catch up on here. <laughs> Oh, I I could see that. I could see that. I I don't like the look of Doom uh, or Wolfenstein, so I completely agree. I'm not a first-person gamer at all. I mean, I don't like first-person shooters. The only one I really have put any time into is uh, Borderlands, and I was really surprised. Um, but other than that, I don't really care for it. But um, it's all very turn-based, um, it just feels very old school, um, but Adrian Odyssey does a, do a good job of it. Uh, I mean, the the difficulty is definitely up there in the old school way of like, very easy to get a, a total party wipe, that sort of thing, but you know, and even small achievements are feel great because of that. It's, See if I can connect this to my other. No, not yet. I can't connect this to my current map yet. But that's okay. Little sign. North is Alisto. West is Alma Mine. South is the. Alright. This way to Celestia. For anyone who doesn't know, I'm actually making a paper nap map right now. <laughs> um, it actually helps a lot because there's a lot of backtracking in this game. Right. That goes to the right here. Um, which, uh, a Train Odyssey game, or... Yeah, they are extremely disorienting. I mean, I was, I, I was mentioning to Danny that, um, um, a few others I have, like, uh, uh Dark Spire and, uh, Strange Journey, Shin Megami Tensei Strange Journey, um, are definitely tough. Another one is even Persona. Uh, the old Persona games are actually first-person RPGs, and they're extremely disorienting, especially since everything looks the same. They they copy and paste a lot of textures, Let's see. And, um, and so it's extremely disorienting. And the really nice thing about Etrian Odyssey is the built-in map feature. Um, it makes it a lot easier. The fact that there are so many maps, um, having it built into the game like that is really nice. Hey, welcome back, Chaos. <laughs> um, I, you know, Danny, I, I'm actually only playing the first one right now, uh, the one that hasn't, uh, prior to the remake. The 3DS uh, Etrian Odyssey Untold is actually a remake of the first one. They polished it up, but you can actually play the classic mode as well. Um, I, you know, depending on if you want to go with the whole thing, um, start with the first one. Otherwise, if you're not concerned about doing the actual series, start with Untold. I heard it's a really good way to get into the series. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to redo the other ones that go along with it. I just want to play the original, um, spot me if it's a take a different route. Um, I wanted to play the original because I heard that they've updated and tweaked things in 
the newer ones to make them easier, like new map features and stuff like that. I didn't want to get spoiled on that stuff um, if I uh, played those first and then went back to the original. Silky! <laughs> Welcome back, Silky. It's been too long. <laughs> of course, I know you love the colored maps, uh, Chaos. I don't know if I'll ever color these in. I'm, I'm very much a black and white sort of person. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they just have lots and lots of reused wall tiles. I mean, um... <laughs> you guys, oh god. Um, and that's the thing, I actually got lost in a Train Odyssey today because they do that thing where they reuse a lot of wall tiles, um, where even if there's something important and when you hit a dead end, it just, the dead end just looks like everything else. So if you don't notice that there's a little icon that says, hey, you should click the area, um, I didn't notice that, and so I was just like, where the fuck am I supposed to go in this map? I've like gone through every single corner, and I didn't realize that there was one dead end that I was supposed to click on something. Um, just hit X, X to leave the floor um, before it triggered some like secret thing. And um, it's supposed to be obvious, but you know, with the, with the visuals being so repetitive, it's so easy to just be like, oh, it's just another dead end, you know. Um, there's also a lot of hidden walls in Atrian Odyssey, and um, that took me a long time when I first played the game, where I was like, I don't know where I'm supposed to go, I'm stuck in this room. No. Oh, Silky. You guys get to see me scroll through the page, the chat here. Alright, well, thanks so much for stopping by, Silky. Get some good rest. Oh, let me unhighlight that. <laughs> Thanks so much for stopping by. It's very sweet of you. It's good to see you. It's been too long. Alright, what am I doing here? Pushing these mushrooms around. Tremors. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> I've considered it chaos. I mean, I figured maybe I'd do it if a if the occasion ever arose. But uh, but you know, I'm still fairly new. I don't have a consistent schedule just yet. Um, I'm also lucky enough that uh, um, I'm doing a pretty low budget stream. So, um, but you know, considering that I am considering getting a new rig or um, buying new games, um, it wouldn't hurt. But you know, it's one of those things where I was like, ah, I've got a full time job. I kind of hate to ask for money. Alright, okay, so let's go ahead and mark this as blocked off. Nope, don't want to go that way. Alright, so there are soldiers here. Blocked. I wonder if... I know, right? Soon? Alright, and this goes down here. And 
to the next screen. Hopefully that mushroom doesn't notice me. Alright, right. Sounds good. Guys, yeah, good to see Reap make his appearance. <laughs> Oh yeah, you've got a lot of yeah, a lot of things going on there, Danny. <laughs> I know, I gotta pick up Awakening. I I have it, I just it's a uh, I know it's gonna be time suck, that thing, because everyone I've talked to <laughs> Are you going through candy? You look like you're going through candy. I think he's going through candy, you guys. You were supposed to be hey, you're supposed to be taking a shower. With candy? <laughs> okay. Back to the game. <laughs> Hopefully my head blocked that. I don't know if you guys caught that. <laughs> oh, Chaos wants to join you. <laughs> Uh, someone's gotta do it. I'm not gonna. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> it is, it is like one o'clock in the morning. You're having candy. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> You, and he says he doesn't have the stream. He doesn't have the itch to stream. <laughs> you have the itch to stream, just not with your current rig. Is that it? Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> that Reaper action. He 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 didn't miss it. <laughs> See, let's write assault here. I know, uh, Danny. I keep. Picking up new RPGs, getting really excited about. It. I was like, oh, I could stream this one. Just picking up old titles I haven't played before, and uh, now that Reaper's here, I have access to his consoles as well, which really opens things up. Not my PS3. Yeah, unfortunately, not his PS3. We we've had some bad luck with uh, Reaper's Reaper's a uh, Reaper's a uh, gear. Unfortunately, oh, that thing came out of nowhere. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, man, those tremors. Of course, they attacked me first. <laughs> oh, and now on to sleeping. Excellent. Uh, let's see what we got here. Recovery. Recovery here. Um. Hmm. Oh, yeah, it's because you can't move. I was trying to figure out why that came up. Um. Uh, 
Oh, great. I forgot that the mushrooms do that. Great. <laughs> oh, you guys are so sweet. Thanks for all the, uh, all the, uh, tweet love. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you, Danny. Thank you. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Uh, I completely forgot that the mushrooms summon this thing. Um, at least it's not the mushroom that uh, does the kamikaze uh, suicide bombing. That's really annoying. Um, let's see. Skill. Interesting chaos. I wonder, do you? That's awesome. That's <laughs> oh, that's awesome, especially considering that you threw away your original one. Um, I wonder if they accidentally sent you two, but that seems really odd. That's really nice, though. You didn't accidentally place the order twice, did you? Yeah, that's tr that's that's correct, Danny. I was uh, saying that I'm thinking of um, actually purchasing a um, a 3DS XL, um, which is awful because I n ha already have two 3DSs, and I have a regular DS, and now I have or I have a DS Lite, and now I have a fat DS for this one, and the idea of getting another 3DS, albeit XL, is a bit much, but. I don't know. It's just, it seems like it'd be nice, especially with the Circle Pad Pro and everything. <laughs> I know, Chaos, I'm sorry. Um, uh, get rid of this guy. Um, yeah, I'd like to pick up a Circle Pad Pro, and I've actually never played any of the Monster Hunters. Oh god, it summoned more. I had no idea. Okay. Um, I don't really have to take out these mushrooms. It's really bad. Uh, let's see. Let's do a left assault here. Okay, good. Oh, is, is he? Is he? Oh, crap. I didn't realize that he's about to die. It's not good. Yeah, I've never actually played any of the Monster Hunters, so it would be really nice. Hopefully I like it. Um, it a lot of it actually kind of reminds me of uh, these mushrooms. Fantasy Star um, Online, which I had played uh, with a friend. Um, I guess I would call him a Chaotic Magus. Magus. I can never remember how to pronounce that word, actually. Um, and let's do an area heal here. Um, oh god, she got rid of him. That was a pretty decent heal, that's good. Um, he had uh, Fantasy Star Online on GameCube when the servers were still up. Uh, I think they were just private servers, nothing too fancy, but uh, they were still available. And uh, it was a great game. It was a really good game. And. Um, just had a really different feel to it than I expected, and Monster Hunter really reminds me of that somehow. Oh, did Boondock send you another controller? That is very sweet. I mean, 
Hopefully Boondock knew that you had ordered one. <laughs> you should have words with him. That's very, very generous of him. Um, I don't think I can move around that. heal herself and he do a fire assault <laughs> sounds good chaos good luck <laughs> Sounds good, Chaos. Okay, I had gone down south here. Goes this way. I think I recall how this works. Slide over here. Uh, let's see. Do we... Oh, she's attacking first now. That was very sweet of him. <laughs> very sweet of Boondock. <laughs> Alright, just do an auto battle on these. up somewhere else.
Nothing wrong with that. Hey, Caleb. <laughs> yeah, those were... The, those were... Hi. <laughs> those were plants I was fighting. Some of them were mushrooms. Some of them were vines that uh, travel underground. Like little tremor things. Um, let's see, I think I go this way. Okay. It does look like I can go that way. I'm also drawing a map right now on graph paper. In case you guys wonder why I keep looking down. <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> Indeed, the monster's numbers have increased. They've grown more savage as well. It's because humans aren't carrying out their duties of protecting the Earth. Damn, those satyrus really hate humans. That's a real problem. Our duty to protect the Earth? Don't you know, Stock? Apparently, you don't. To live on this continent without knowing how it all came to be. A lamentable state of things. Kafka, quit picking on Stark. I meant him no disrespect. It's just, as one who lives on this continent, I... Oh, damn. I'm not gonna scream, guys. For those of you who know me, I... I don't scream. <laughs> Aye! I'll do that one, though. <laughs> what was that sound? It came from that way. Oh, wow. <laughs> Sounds good, Chaos. It'll be good to have you watching us. Is it just a vacation for yourself, or is it a vacation from work or anything like that? It came from that way. I bet it's some monsters attacking. We gotta rescue them. Let's go. Ooh, book. Time to save. Save always. Let me fix this path that I drew here. Alright. Looks like a. Let's see. Yeah, looks like this path curls to the left here. There's a save point there, which is nice. Are we ready to begin? Um, he has a good point. I should probably check to see if uh, um, yeah, I'm not ready. <laughs> let's see. Um, let's see. I should probably heal. Well, thanks, Digidad. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for everyone joining me today. It's a late night cast, I know. <laughs> Dallas South to meet up with family. Very nice cast. It sounds like a lot of fun. Well, yeah, I don't blame you for not really being most stream in that sort of case. All right, let's see what we got here. Um. I'm tempted to... Hmm. Actually, let me go north first. See if it'll let me. I'm tempted to go to an inn and rest, but I don't know if it'll let me just yet. But yeah. Caleb, this is another example of the plant. I can uh, knock them unconscious before the fight to get an upper hand. There they are. There's also these those adorable purple jelly jelly enemies there. These little guys hopping around. Cloudies. Green leech. Let's see. <laughs> Sounds good, Chaos. I know you do that anyway, so nothing new there. <laughs>
tough when these these guys can't be pushed around. It's a little tough to try to figure out the best uh, course of action. I mean, maybe I'll have him push. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like a chaos. <laughs> and just attack those guys. Go this way. <laughs> Chaos. Yeah, we do what we can to help everyone. It's definitely, definitely the way of the, our communities, our crossover communities here. Okay, she can do Starlight, I guess. How's she doing on MP? Not so great. I guess all of the plants can summon some sort of Audrey 2 character. That's what it looks like, at least. Okay. Get rid of them. Ah, great poison. That's not good. Yeah, we're definitely all in this together, Chaos. Theme may see more. That's all I think whenever I see that guy. <laughs> Raphael. 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 Rafflesia. It's like Raffle. Rafflesia? Maybe Rafflesia? Uh, I'll just do regular attacks on this, on this guy. Let's roll it down. Oh man, I forgot about this poison. <laughs> Everyone's dying. Everyone's dying on me. damage every time they even act at that point. Alright, let's see. <laughs> I know, burn them, right? I will. Oh, okay. They won't let me go up there right now. Um, I guess... I kind of want to go back to the inn, but I think at this point maybe I'll just use my MP. Hey kitty! <laughs> Long time no see. Good to see you. I know the people selling me the mana shards where I can um, heal myself up uh, at any book like this for $5,000, however. Um, I was like, Pfft. but now in this sort of situation it would have been helpful. <laughs> uh, exactly, Caleb. Exactly. That bionic button, though. Oh, I should not be getting tired. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that Martin cat, though. Oh, man, this is game. That must be the group the patriarch was talking about. Leave this to me. 
What am I fighting? Am I fighting a Snorlax? Looks like a big furry pedo Snorlax, honestly. Uh, let's see what we got here. Oh dear, let me s yawning. It's barely been an hour. <laughs> I was hoping I'd get a little longer of a longer of a thing going on. Let's see. What's the weakness on this? I know, fatty head. <laughs> I know, and just like, look at that huge, like, it's, it's a bit of a ball sack chin, to be honest. Welcome back, Reap. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we were listening to the um, Necro Dancer soundtrack, by the way, and Reap has definitely been enjoying his share of uh, skeleton, skeleton gyration dancing. <laughs> that pelvic bone thrust. <laughs> Chaos is welcome back. <laughs> yes, yeah, just one single ball. <laughs> <laughs> Just, I mean, look at him. It's <laughs> uh, I don't think I can push this guy, but... Oh, is she about to die? She's not doing so well, huh? Let's give her a heal. Um, I don't think I have ice, though. So that's not good. Um... The only thing I can think of doing is maybe doing a push. <laughs> oh god. Oh god, he's eating the grass. That's not good. What I could do is remove his turn. This will work, but it's worth a shot. Mm -hmm. All right, cat. <laughs> Your drawings have been looking really good, by the way. I've been noticing them on, on my Twitter feed. Oh, oh, dear. All them yawns. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> of course, cat. Let's see if this works. Oh, it did work. Nice. Good to know.
I know, I know. The yawn is real. I was feeling totally fine. But, uh, now, now it's a bit rough. <laughs> Alright, well he's about half dead. I'm pretty much dead though. Not doing so well. Uh, let's see. She could do... Hmm. I'm gonna change with her. I don't know if you guys can do that. <laughs> so, so pretty. <laughs> I guess you could hear it then. <laughs> yes, it was chaos. <laughs> yes, it was. <laughs> damage there. Wrecked. <laughs> nice. Excellent. What splendid skill. You saved our lives. <laughs> My name is Vanos, and I am the leader of this troop. Vanos. Uncle Vanos! Ah, dear aunt, you've grown so much while I was away. You're the ones the patriarch mentioned then. That's us. We're doing a tour of duty around across the continent as traveling performers. Oh yeah, that that pelvic thrust. <laughs> Aw, oh, thanks. Thanks, Kat, for the follow, by the way. Periodically, we make trips back to Celestia to deliver whatever information and supplies we can find. <sighs> oh, that bunny emo. I'm glad you're all safe. The monsters in this area normally pose no threat, but there are an unusual number of them, all with a vicious temperament. We owe our survival to you three. I really can't thank you enough. There's no need for thanks. No need to stay here any longer, either. Let's get back to Celestia. Event Beastkind's favor has been revised. <laughs> Let me thrust in your general direction. I see, so the situation in the wider world continues to worsen. 
Grandnorg was in utter chaos. We scarcely escaped. You can barely call what's going on there a war anymore. Grandnorg is perpetually on the run from Alistair's overwhelming military might. Then Grandnorg will fall. It seems their karma has caught up with them. Their problem is what happens afterwards. Who exactly rules Alistair? The common consensus that the front line is that General Hugo has full authority over the army. There's no knowing how true that is without actually venturing into Alistair, though. I've heard rumors of this Hugo. I doubt he's a trustworthy human, to say the least. Hmm. Peace doesn't necessarily follow war, but... I'm sorry, Vanos, but I ask that you head to Alistair as soon as you can. Such as a lot of we travelers. Never fear, Patriarch. I'll be on my way soon. Then rest well. You must be tired from your long journey. Yes, please excuse me. So Hugo has full control of Alistair now. I wonder if Lieutenant General Roll is safe. It's seeming like I'll need to revisit Alistair as dangerous as that may be. I need to see what it's like on the ground, and if possible, meet with Lieutenant General Rawl somehow. I should ask Vanos if he'd mind me tagging along. Ott to Slefter Party. Gafka Slefter Party. Report from Vanos has been added as an event. I was just saying that I never hear any good rumors about Hugo. Although they're just rumors, so who knows what's true. <laughs> Can anyone really be that evil? He doesn't seem to view other people as anything more than trash. He won't think twice about killing any number of people just to keep his position. That's the kind of man he is. If that's true, then he's no different than Queen Protea of Grand Org. Alright guys, I think I'm going to have to call it. I hate calling it so early, but I can definitely feel me fading. <laughs> I thought I'd be able to do better because I went to bed like at 2 or 3 last night and uh, I was still pretty wide awake and now I'm just like, oh, I can barely read. <laughs> that maiden. <laughs> There she is. Let's go ahead and find a save point. I know I hate doing these short streams to you guys, but part of it was just me wanting to uh, get back into this game. Um, we did make some progress, at least. Uh, and, um, yeah, so we'll see. Alright. Then you guys can get the full normal view of my exhaustion. <laughs> But uh, like I said, I have some friends coming by um, tomorrow. There's reap, and uh, and so I should get some rest to try to clean up the area. I don't know if they're going to be staying in this bedroom or not. It's going to be kind of a full house, um, and if so, I don't really have much um, floor space for them. So uh, we'll see. I'll see what I can do. Um, so I probably will not be streaming tomorrow. I don't think reap will be streaming tomorrow either. Um, yes, that full HD day so. I'm using Reap's uh, camera at, at that. I know, the exhaustion is real. Yeah, you should still try to get some rest, Chaos. It's not it's not safe for you. Don't pull a man versus game now, you know. Get some rest when you can, or else you're going to find yourself like Raiko and uh, streaming at 5 in the morning. Uh, or even earlier uh, at his time. And, uh, and yeah. You know, and then the rest of us end up missing it because we're actually sleeping. So, anyway, have a good one, everyone. Thanks so much for coming by. I really appreciate it. Um, I don't think anyone else is streaming right now. If I wanted to uh, pull in a, a little hosting or anything like that, I definitely appreciate all the folks who um, uh, came by. Everyone new and old. And kid, kids at heart, of course. Let's see what we got. 
<laughs> Mother Day, so I don't know about that. <laughs> good night, Kato. So good seeing you. Uh, I don't really see anyone. No one is streaming right now. No wonder so many people are in here. <laughs> well, anyway. Um, yeah, hopefully I will be streaming again soon. I really do like this game quite a bit. Um, I might get to a point where I might finish a Train Odyssey fairly soon. It's looking like I'm making some good progress and, um, but, um, and I just unlocked, uh, the last class. So I'm getting there with that. So we might get to see some Etrian Odyssey pretty soon too. Um, no promises of when that'll be, but I'll definitely let you guys know, keep you posted. Um, but yeah, yeah. So hopefully I'll see you guys just in a few days, probably not, uh, Sunday or Monday, but, uh, maybe one of the weekends or weeknights after, uh, one of the, the, uh, renowned Archelaus streams, um, Thank you, Danny. Thank you. Hopefully we'll see you soon uh, in either uh, this stream or one of the other streams I have listed below. So, um, but yeah, Chaos is a streamer as well, as long, uh, just like Reaper, um, and uh, and as is uh, Silky, actually. He should be streaming too soon, so we'll see. But all right, everyone, we'll have a great one, and uh, I will see you guys next time. All right, see ya.